Hey guys, this is Abomination9 here, back playing some more uh, Pokemon trading card game online. We left off, again, more critters. Uh, hopefully we can get a good match, like that's what I'm trying to look for here, an actual good match. That lasts a while, so we can actually see what we can do. So far we haven't gotten that. Okay, please actually be something good. Okay, water and a normal. Don't know how this is going to turn out. Uh, heads. It's pretty much been heads all night. Okay, all we got was... Well, we got Death Skull too. Oh, he didn't have any cards. I don't know, do I want- I think I want Venipede out, because Venipede will do more for me right now. With the poison. Okay, he's running a... Greninja deck. I swear to god if this is a Manfi EX. Yes, I desperately need another card. Okay, it's a Sfeel. Please give me some energy! How? Are you kidding me? I can't believe I got screwed over like that. Okay, we can get a Whirlpeed, I guess. Do you want to just... What do we have? We can get a Golette. Hell, let's just get Whirlpeed. We have no energy, but there's no way we're not going to be getting any next turn. Essentially, he's been given first turn because I didn't draw energy. There's no way for me to really recover from that. Okay, he is going to go for that Sfeel. He does have an Articuno to deal with. He also has a Magikarp, which I'm assuming he's going to turn into a Gyarados. So we have to deal with Gyarados, we have to deal with... Uh, we have to deal with Gyarados, we have to deal with... Greninja, eventually. We have to deal with that Articuno, getting multiple prize cards. What does this do? This Pokemon has no weaknesses. Which is metal, I don't even have a metal Pokemon. Okay, finally some energy. I'm not going to evolve him. Because I want that poison. He's going to do the 20, I'm going to do that. He's going to get the 30. And possibly a... Paralysis. Okay, got the paralysis, so because we need to start getting that damage in, I'm going to actually uh, do this. And Nurse Joy. And then get the poison started. Then we're going to put the double on him. Might have made a bad play. I don't feel like I should be playing Whirlpeed because Whirlpeed is such a... I don't know. So he can hit for... 50. I'm actually just going to sacrifice Whirlpeed here. Or Venipede, I mean. Because I want that, uh, poison. 
It said you may discard any stadium. You just screwed yourself pretty badly there, man. I don't know what you thought was going to happen there. Uh, though, but yeah, I'm going to... Actually, I should probably should be using this on Duskull, right? So, let's grab Dusclops. And get that poison off. Start taking that poison. He's in a bad spot because he has no cards in his hand. Of course, Warpeed's dead now. Uh, let's just get this out. It's 40. So I think this counts as 3. Is 100 damage? So it's dead next turn? If this is indeed 100 damage. It's dead from the poison. Yes. And there was our... Scolipede was inside there anyway, so good thing I made sure to not evolve him to get that poison running. Articuno is not a Pokemon we want to be dealing with. I might retreat. Because if it kills this, then that's three. Depending on what happens here. Okay, it's still asleep. I'm going to put the energy on him. Okay, Wobbuffet. I don't know how we're having an energy problem with all my Pokemon in my hand, but whatever. I don't know. We just have to hope, I think. We just have to hope that it wakes up at some point. Just wake up next turn, please. Otherwise, this is all for naught. It's already asleep. Oh my god, come on, this is not cool. Give me a Nurse Joy. It's finally awake, but he's probably gonna do its damage. I don't think it can kill me. Okay. That's two energy. If she attacks and doesn't use... I think even if she flips all heads... She won't be able to kill Lugia. Her best- or oh, her, why am I saying her? His best bet would be to put it to sleep, but he chose not to. That won't kill because of the armor, and it just didn't do enough anyways. I will heal it though. Can't do anything, but I will do Aura Ball because this should kill it. Right, we're gonna make sure though. 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 100, 20, 140. This better do 140 damage. Thank you. Because sometimes you don't know. So this Lugia only has 70 HP right now. He might have a Gyarados. Or he might just be buying time for his spheels to beef up. Epic Splash. Each player shuffles her hand into his or her deck, then... Well, I mean, all I got is freaking Pokemon I can't use, so thank you, man. I think I only get to draw four? Yeah. Oh my god, energy, thank you. Plus, you have put me ahead, card-wise, deck-wise. Ooh, that's... Oh, ten, what the heck? 
Uh, I was expecting something else. Uh, well, this will kill that, but let's actually get some... So what does your attack do, Wobbuffet? This attack does 10 more damage for each damage counter on your attacked Pokemon, which would be itself. Or we can do damage counters, which I think... Let's build up him. Uh, let's just kill Magikarp. Okay, now we can get our Golurk out. This is actually going pretty well. I mean, we haven't even... This is the damage counters deck, and I have yet to actually effectively use the counter, like, mechanic. Like, really? Four. He only gets to draw four. He already played an energy on his Dudo. He's sacrificing uh, C. Leo here. I won't actually be able to kill it either way. So if I add another energy, he'll be able to do 100 damage, which won't break through the armor. Heal. That sets me back a bit, though. We just got lucky with this. Both of these do- oh, actually. Clearly, he could have bought so much more time. He could have bought more. I wouldn't have been able to kill C. Leo with either <clears throat> attack. But then he gave me that kill by playing that stadium. Has he played an energy on that yet? I think he did, so he's only going to be able to do 20 damage. And I will be should be able to kill that, no problem. Is it twenty times? Oh, I have armor on. Now we have more energy to give around. So. This is pretty much it for him. I think this is at least a fitting way to go out since we actually got a fight and he hasn't given up yet. And he only has 20 cards out of the 60 we started off with. He only has 22 cards left. So I think that's a decent fight to end off on. Okay. He's trying to get something. Anything. He has to some way allow me to not kill that feel though I it's not gonna happen that feels dead uh, can I evolve it oh I can I, I will I want to evolve this just to, for the sake of doing it but it doesn't really matter because it is dead no matter what and there we go an actual decent fight it's just a heavy ball left Oh, come on. I hate this wheel because it always spins around the exact same spot, giving me the exact same thing over and over again. Like, I don't know how many times uh, I played the other day and it just went around and hit the exact same spot. I had no other places hit. I only had one spot on the wheel hit. Everything else was free game. And it hit the same spot over and over and over again. The wheel is rigged. Like, it's super rigged. Oh uh, yeah, guys, uh, that should be the last Pokemon video for today. I did a lot today. Uh, maybe I'll actually just stream tomorrow. Uh, so that uh, it isn't as... I don't know. I don't have to do as much work. I can just do all one long session if I'm going to keep doing this. Instead of uploading like 6,000 videos. So yeah, guys, uh, thanks for watching. Tune into the next episode. Like, subscribe, comment, you know what to do. See ya.